Hey, what's up guys? We are currently in hand cam mode, because reasons. Well, the point of this video, guys, you probably already saw if you read the title, but I've had a bunch of Pokemon cards from when I was a kid, and I sold off most of them. However, I didn't sell off these. For some reason, I still have this little stack of cards. It's probably, I don't know, what's that, 200 maybe? So I have no idea what these cards are, aside from the guy on top here. I haven't looked at these in probably about 10 years, so I have no idea if I have anything good or not. So I guess let's just go through these and see together. Let's see what I have. I'm just going to grab a little stack at a time. Let's just, let's just go through them. So of course we have the Farfetch'd on top. That's a base set Farfetch'd. We have some Grass Energy. Grass Energy. <laughs> Lots of Grass Energies. And before this is just a giant stack of energies. Looking back over at the pile, that's an energy on top. So maybe it's just maybe we're just going to have a bunch of energy cards here. Uh... That one's upside down. Oh, you can see some of them have the little star icon and the, uh, whatever that is, the swirl icon. So I guess some of them are different sets, but they're a bunch of grass energies. There you go. Let's get that pile out the way. Let's grab a new stack. Oh, I see a fire energy over there. Maybe there's more types of energies. Maybe it's not just fire. Uh, grass, grass energy. Ew, that one's... That one got way messed up. You probably will notice a lot of these cards are in bad condition because these are from when I was a kid and I played a lot with these, so they are going to be messed up, but dang, that one is like real messed up. Just, oh wait, 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 wait. One water energy, wow. So I have a bunch of grass energies. I'm, I'm good to go. If I want to make a deck of 60 grass energies, I am, I am well off of my way to do that. Ooh. There's something that's not a, an energy card right there, so we're probably going to get to some other stuff here. Let's just get through these fire energies. Ooh, okay, we have a Stantler. That is from one of the Neo sets. I can't remember which one. I keep accidentally turning my camera there. So I don't know which one that is, but it's one of the one of the Neo sets. Looks like it's in terrible condition. Looks like it got bit by something there. Ooh, I have a Teddy Ursula. Nice. That's one of my favorite Pokemon. Check that out. Got Slackoth. I don't know a lot of what these sets are. Ooh, another Teddy Ursa. Cool. Ooh, Persian. That's a base set two Persian. Uh, my hand's kind of casting a shadow on the cards. I'll have to readjust my lights later. This is kind of my first time doing this. I think I might do some more Pokemon card pack openings. I want to get back into collecting these, so that's kind of why I'm doing this, to show you where my collection is. And throughout the coming days and weeks and months, whatever, I'll probably do more videos of actually opening cards and stuff. So that'll be fun. Here we have a Jungle Meowth. A first edition Jungle Meowth. Wow. Another Persian, base set 2, double colorless energy, we have a horsey, you can kind of see back there a Magikarp's peeking out, we'll have to see what set that is. A Merrill, Quillfish, Whalmer, uh, looks like a Team Rocket Magikarp, and a base set 2 Squirtle. So maybe I actually have all my cards separated by type, we went through a bunch of normal types and now we're in water, so... Oh, oh boy, back over there we have more grass energies, fantastic. Okay. So here, Dugong is actually very interesting. I have a funny story about this card. Way back in the day, one of my friends actually pulled a base set Charizard. But Dugong was their favorite Pokemon. I did not even make this offer. They offered it to me. And they offered a base set Charizard for a Dugong. So that was a trade I actually made. I don't have the base set Charizard anymore because I, I traded it to a friend. I got a good trade. I didn't trade it for a dang Dugong. I actually got... 10 G.I. Joe action figures for it, so I didn't make no bad trades, but oh well. Anyways, we got Team Rocket Squirtle, Magikarp, War Turtle Base Set 2, War Turtle Regular Base Set, Water Energies. Oh, maybe they're not sorted by type. We have a Vigoroth right here. We have, uh, I, don't know, I don't know what set these are. It is one of the ones with the e-reader things on the bottom, though. So I guess if I've ever had an e-reader, I could do that. And looks like we got some grass types. Oh, actually, I remember I, I showed this one off in a video, so I know I have seen at least this one. Because I showed this off in one of my videos. So I do have a Yanma. I have a Bayleaf. Oop, let's flip these over. We got Ivysaur, Bulbasaur. Ooh, Trico. Again, one of my favorite Pokemon here. We have Grovile. I wonder if I have a Sceptile somewhere. We got Chikorita, Heracross, First Edition Pineco, Bayleaf, Ladybug, and a Ladian. Just an uncommon. No real rare cards at all right now. Let's see what else we got. On the stack over there on top looks like a some type of trainer. Let's just keep going. Got more grass energies. Why do I have so many grass energies? Jeez. Okay, I got Gust of Wind, Professor Elm, uh, Pokeball, Defender, 
energy removal, energy retrieval, plus power. These are all my trainers. I'm just going to go through these quickly. Probably not going to name every single one off. This one's actually a cool one, though. Lucky Stadium. I just like the card art for that one. Got the two do duos down there battling it out. Bill. Master Ball. Cool. More. More Bills. Hyper D Evolution Spray. Uh, Boss's Way. Pokemon March. Okay, so a bunch, a bunch of trainers here. Uh, let's just grab a big stack. Arcade game, so that's the one that was on top there. We have other stuff. I gotta get used to like holding the cards here. I keep wanting to put them here, but that's kind of like out of focus and not in the frame that well. So let me go here, and I'll next time I'll fix the light so the shadow on my thumb is not on the cards. But whatever. We got defender, energy removal, more trainers. Going through these quickly. No one cares about these, right? Ooh, we have a dark vile plume. I think that is a rare. Cool. We have ooh Ursa Ring as well. Pincer. Oh my gosh, I have another funny story about Pinsir. Uh, I, I guess I have a lot of really good trades that I've made in the past as a kid. My friend traded me a base set Venusaur for one of these Pinsir cards because he was doing the whole thing where you want to build like the Pokedex, you want to have all 151, and the last one he needed was a Pinsir. So he was like, dude, I know this is a bad trade. He wasn't dumb, you know, like he, he knew it was a bad trade, but he's like, I want that Pinsir. Here, take a Venusaur. And I was like, okay, so I took it. Here we have a Dark Gyarados. Mmm. Aerodactyl. Here comes Team Rocket. I love this card. Each player plays with his or her prize cards face up for the rest of the game. Always a fun one just to, I guess, make things a little bit less random. And over there on top is a base set Charmander, it looks like. Here we have Dark Macar... Oop, I see some shinies back there. We have a Ditto from Fossil. Very cool. Oh, there's that Sceptile I was hoping for. I still have this guy. Cool. Oh, we got holographics. There's a Meganium. Uh, okay, we just have one holographic. Dark Charizard. Oh, that is a shiny as well. We have Dark Typhlosion. Nice. Camerupt, also a shiny. Shiny, shiny. Rocket Scyther. That's cool. Clefable from the jungle set. Nice. Ooh, a base set Clefairy. Nice. Doesn't look too beat up either. And a base set 2 Chansey. Uh, reverse holographic slacking. Oh, this is Celebi. I thought that was a promo card for some reason. Is that a promo? What set is that? I don't know. Let's see. We got Dark Blastoise. Another Megate. Why do I have two of these? A Reverse Holographic Slugma. Deli Bird. Oh, nice! I have a base set Blastoise. I had no idea. And a Typhlosion EX. I don't know if that's good, but I have it. Okay. Typhlosion EX. I know you can't. It's a little bit blurry, but I think you guys can read that. There's his moves and everything. Wow! Okay, I have a base set Venusaur. I think this might be the same Venusaur that I was talking about before with the pincer trade. I think this is the actual Venusaur that I got. Uh, let's see. Macargo. Cyndaquil. Dark Quilavas. Schneckmag. <laughs> what the heck? What language is that? Schneckmag. Dark Charmeleon. A Charmander. Okay. The last little stack right here, this is all I have left. Let's go through it. We have Charmander, we have Macargo, Slugma, Cyndaquil, Numo, Numo, a different type, Fire Energy, and the rest is just a bunch of Fire Energies it looks like. So I guess that's it guys. I had, I guess the highlights of that are I had two holographic Meganiums, a base set Venusaur, a base set Charizard, and I guess Typhlosion EX. I don't know if Typhlosion EX is particularly fancy, but there you go, guys. That is my remaining Pokemon card collection. So I'm going to try to add to this over the coming days on this channel. If you guys are into this type of stuff, you should subscribe and check out some more. I think it'll be fun. I actually bought a few uh, tins that are coming along the way, so I'll be opening those, and it'll be a good time. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time. Take care!